Hi folks, G3 here and welcome to another edition of my journey I take to go green. Today I'm going to be looking at compostable bags. For some time I have been using plastic bags for my bins in the house. So that's my kitchen bin, bathroom and, and others like that. So I'll be filling that up through the week and then gathering those, tying them up and taking it out for the weekly collection. That's an awful lot of plastic to go to landfill. Now, as time's gone on, the amount of rubbish I've produced has been going down and down. I'm recycling more and I'm throwing a lot less away. But it was still concerning me, obviously, that I was filling up plastic bags to throw away into the landfill. For some time I've been recycling my food waste. The council here is very good at collecting that food waste and going and, and using it for other means so they tend to convert it into compost or some councils will use it for generating energy. Uh, there's a variety of things that they'll be using it for. I've been using the compostable bags that tend to be made of cornstarch to collect my food waste for the weekly collection. They've been pretty good, they're relatively affordable, they tend to be fairly strong and it got me thinking now if the bags there are suitable for collecting the food on a regular basis why can't I use that for the bins in the house? So I did a little bit of research online and I ended up at a website called allgreen.co.uk and I'll include the link to their website after um, after the video. Now there are many many different suppliers of these bags but those are the ones that I've used for some time now. I've found them to be pretty competitive price-wise. They're very uh, quick at delivering. The postage is all very reasonable. I'm still happy to be using those but obviously you do your research and find out who you can find to supply you with the bags that you need at the right price for you. So I looked on the All Green website and I found that they did a number of different bags in various different sizes and various different types. Now I wasn't really sure what size I needed because it's a while since I bought my bins I, I don't really know what size they are and they're generally measured in litres for the capacity. So I had a look on the All Green website and I saw that they had this great facility where you can buy a little pack if you're not sure as to the size of your bins you can buy a pack of three or four different similar sizes so that you can check out which one fits best before you then go and commit to buying more from them and these were retailing for I think £1.49 for the pack so I, was, I got one of those sent it they sent it out to me so that I was able to then judge the size of the bins from that I knew that I had 10 litres for my compostable waste for the kitchen I had six litre capacity in the little bin that I've got in my bathroom and had a 30 litre capacity in the kitchen for the larger bin. So I was able to stock up on those particular size bags. Now let's take a little bit of a closer look at those. Here's the 30 litre bag, they have some branding on the outside, it tells you that it's a 30 litre compostable bag, that it's biodegradable and compostable and certified to EN13432 which is the, um, the standard for um, showing that these bags are going to be compostable within and biodegradable within a certain period of time. Now they're approved for use by most local councils but obviously you need to check your local council to see whether they accept bags that are, are uh, made to this certification. The bottom of these bags they have a star shaped gather in. Now these help increase the strength of the bottom of the bags. These 30 litre bags start at £5.99 for 10, although if you buy in bulk you can get that down to £25.99 for 100 bags. So that's working out approximately 26 pence per bag. Now I found some plastic bags on Amazon that came in at approximately 20 pence per bag. Now assuming I use one of these bags a week, which I do, that's an extra 6 pence a week. So over the course of the year, it's costing me an extra £3.12 to use these bags as opposed to the plastic bags. But I think £3.12 is a worthwhile cost from ensuring that I am not contributing extra plastic into the landfill from the bags I'm using in my kitchen. 
these six litre bags that I've got for using in the bathroom, now they cost 5 99 for 50. You can bulk buy them though for 29 99 for 500 from allgreen.co.uk. So that equates to six pence per bag. Now, equivalent sized plastic ones from Amazon, I managed to locate for round about five pence a bag. So it's only one pence a bag extra. Now, I tend to get through one of these a week again. So that's only an extra 52 pence a year for using these biodegradable, compostable bags for my waste from the bathroom. So again, I'm stopping one extra plastic bag a week from going into landfill from using these. Now, of course, you can get alternative bags that are made from recycled plastic, but they're not biodegradable or compostable. So they tend to market themselves saying that they are um, superior bags because they are recycled plastic and that they're stronger than the compostable and biodegradable bags, which may be true. They may be a little bit stronger, but they're not biodegradable and compostable. So it is still plastic that when you throw it away is going to be making it into landfill. Well, there you go. That's another tip from me on making small changes to go green. Changing the plastic bags you use for your refuse over to the cornstarch variety that are biodegradable and compostable. Of course, you can't go pouring liquids into them, which you know, I wouldn't do in a, a regular plastic bag anyhow. I found them to be very strong, able to support the, the rubbish that I've been throwing away, and I've been extremely pleased with them. So I challenge you to also take that step. Let me know in the comments how it goes for you. I'd love to hear, and join me soon for another step that I take to go green. Don't forget, folks, if you like this video, then please, Click the like button there and subscribe as well so that you can get more hints and tips from me. And obviously tell your friends, share the video. The more people that come and, and start watching, the more people that will hopefully be making those little steps to go green. I hope to see you soon. Bye.